Hey, what's up? This is Shamika with Live Footage 215, and we're here with Certified Young Core, and I'm 16. My name is Miss Cheeks, and I'm 17. My name is Ryan, and I'm 16. Okay, so what made y'all interested in performing and rapping and singing? Uh, well, first of all, I'm a music major. I love music, so I do lots of things like drumming, rapping, choreography, yeah, cutting, sure. rap. I just started, you know what I'm saying, rapping myself. I felt I had the talent to do it, so I so kept doing it. And these is family right here. It's all family right here, so we just decided to start a group, and we formed Certified G, so. Come together as a group. My cousin came home from drum practice one day from to the to marching band drumming. So we came home one day and he was sitting at the countertop. I'm throwing beats on that I made, and he was like, "You made those?" And blah blah blah. And to make the long story short, he just he was first a singer and uh, then became a rapper. So once we got him, we just stayed together with it and kept doing it. Good. So what are some of you guys' influences in music? Well, T.I. T.I.P. That's my influence right there. Yeah, he's a good rapper. I don't hardly curse that much, but yeah, I like T.I. Um, I like uh, Aretha Franklin, oh, yeah, Yolanda. Yeah, Tupac and Biggie are the big influences on my music. Kizzle being a real third grade lyricist out here. Tupac and Biggie are the big If y'all ever see this, I want to give like a big shout out because these are really our influence. Really, it is C.I. Flames, which is my older cousin, which is 25, and my uncle, K.G, which are also rappers and they own groups and do other things and they rappers. So when y'all see this, y'all big influence to the Certified G, so thank y'all for letting us, helping us get up there. Good. You're well spoken, I must say. <laughs> so, my last question of the day is, where, what are your plans? Where do you guys see yourself five years, ten years from now? Well, I always keep a backup plan, you know what I'm saying? If I don't see myself doing this, I would never drop music. I can continue doing more stuff like drumming and uh, teaching people how to do everything with music. But if it do work out, I want to see me and my crew and my family, you know what I'm saying? On the beach in Miami, chilling in a big crib, you know what I'm saying? Putting our records out there for people and to enjoy, you know what I'm saying? Because nowadays, rap is just nothing to people, but people just getting on tracks cursing and just doing everything, talking about girls and blah, blah, blah. They all on the same tip. And my crew right now, we trying to bring a new air into the game because we, one, we don't curse. Two, we don't degrade, I mean, degrade women. But we talk about the stuff that, you know what I'm saying, we do. Because you ain't a real rapper if you ain't talking about what you do in your life. You feel what I'm saying? Going out here stunting like you got cars and got chains and got money is not cool. So, as to me, I just see it's Doing big things right now. Say, keep it funky. Alright. You got anything to add? Yeah, as far as my plan, if I don't maybe as a rapper within five to six years from now, I always had an interest in playing football. Um, being a sports person. I also like doing construction, which is my backup plan. Uh, well, before we leave y'all, I want to bring Mr. Godfather, aka Mr. Craig one of the managers in Certified G's to talk to you about stuff that's going to be going on really in the Certified G. So give it up for Mr. Craig. Mr. Craig, the godfather, the manager. <laughs> How you doing? Uh, How you doing? We got some big plans um, going on for the new year. Uh, we're going down Wildwood. We're going to do, do um, their theme song for them. Uh, um, we got a hold of the uh, Chamber of Commerce down there. We're going to do the actual rap version of their Wild World Game song. And we got a hold of Disney. They want to do something new also. So they, right now, it's in uh, negotiation as far as contract wise and, and TV show wise and so forth. So we got everything rolling 
what we're doing. We're going to go down to the Apollo show, of course. We got to hit the Apollo, so say well, you know, we've been there and did that. So uh, they doing very well. Like we're dealing to rehearse a lot more, it'd be a lot easier. But other than that, you know, uh, they're good with the family, um, they're all family, you know, like you said. And uh, I see nothing but positive things happen. Good, well, this is Certified G's. They're doing their thing. They're going to be at the mixtape party that they have coming up. And they have a mixtape coming out too with us. So look out for them. Check this out on YouTube. That's where we're going to post it for y'all. <laughs> and thank you so much. Anything else y'all want to add? Or? One, two, three, CG. Chick, not a gold digger When other niggas be stressing you You show your bold finger You like to bounce with your man I call you Lady Tigger In the sheets I'll be your producer And you can be